Ocean plates are also involved, more particularly in the process of seafloor spreading. This involves the mid-ocean ridges, which are a system of narrow submarine cracks that can be traced down the center of the major oceans. The ocean floor is being continuously pulled apart along these mid-ocean ridges. Hot volcanic material rises from the Earth's mantle to fill the gap and continuously form new oceanic crust. Volcanoes are mountains, but they are very different from other mountains. There are more than 500 active volcanoes on the planet that have erupted at least once within recorded history. Volcanoes are not formed by folding and crumpling, but by uplift and erosion. They are built by the accumulation of their own eruptive products. Lava, crusted over ash flows, and airborne ash and dust. A volcanic plume is a mixture of particles and gas emitted by an eruption. Plumes are generated by fragmentation of magma and may reach heights of up to 80 kilometers. According to scientists and geologists, the Earth's hotspots are under the influence of extraterrestrial, electromagnetic, and gravitational wave influence. The Earth's magnetic field is changing rapidly, and as it's also induced by the Sun's magnetic field, which is also in a weak period, perhaps we will see an apparent increase in volcanic activity, or the awakening of long-dormant volcanic fields. <laughs> 